Next, we have uh, the live action game Gamer Girl. After its release, the trailer for Gamer Girl was met with severe backlash. Following this, Wales Interactive has pulled the controversial trailer from its YouTube channel and released a statement defending its stance on the focus of the game. Gamer Girl is intended to be a full motion video or FMV game where players will act as the moderator to up and coming live streamer Abby Cake 99. Through real time chat scenarios and leveling mod abilities, the goal of the game is to guide Abby's choices as she navigates through a troubling scenario. The plot revolves around an anonymous chat member who becomes more and more of a threat by stalking the live streamer. Dun dun dun! Backlash! Gosh. I feel like it's just like proving the point of the game. <laughs> of like, how dare you make a game about harassment of women in the game? industry will harass you till you take it down exactly cancer culture activate <laughs> i mean it was it was it's, it's like is there not a like a boardroom that would have told these people like i don't think this is a good idea <laughs> you know it sounds awesome like honestly i think that sounds super interesting but you, you, uh, did you did you watch the trailer did you see? I didn't get a chance to. I, I'm t if you, it's it's not like your traditional video game. It's live. Right. It's real like videos and whatnot. And you make That's decisions super and cool. and um, so this woman acted it all out. But Twitter just had a whole day with this. Uh, like like how are we, like you're glamorizing these things that we're really going through. I'm like and there are streamers. There are female streamers who do go through this. And, yeah. Oh, no, but I think that's this. why the game's important. Like. To bring what to, better way to talk about this in the gaming industry than mm -hmm. with video games? That's in, that's interesting. See, I thought I would I would have had money that you would have been like for the uh, the the whole yes this is this is exploiting something that's a that so you're you're saying that you, I think it depends on how they handle it. Like I I'm not I don't know a ton about the game. I think there is room for a really interesting conversation right. to be opened about what what this huge issue in this industry looks right. like via the industry right. but yeah i i it's a fine line for sure and i think it would just depend on the you know sort of how they go about if it feels like execution. a conversation or if yeah. it just feels like <laughs> isn't like a, this like isn't this funny how we torture this little young lady yeah, yeah like that's what i was worried about like if it's now you're probably right because this is this is just a trailer the, the point of the trailer is to get people talking about it and raise people's expectations of it. Mm -hmm. And the, it was immediately met with your, your glamorizing, you know, something mm -hmm. such and such, which, you know, and I, and I probably should have read up a little bit more because um, the makers of the games, they had their statements and they, and they defended themselves a little bit. So if you're right, if I, I I'm going to agree with you on that. If it is just like, Hey, this is a story based on like, what do they say? You know, it's art imitating life. If it's you know this is a story based on some stuff that we're that um that goes on and but if it i guess i don't know i guess it'll it'll be evident if it's like just exploiting it and like the pain of what real people go through and whatnot but at the same time art imitating life i mean that's that's true about anything i mean a few years after the tower the twin uh, the towers fell in 2011 uh no, not let me sorry 9 11 um there was a movie about it already people were like is this too soon is this this um, a couple of years ago, there was a video game that was made. I forgot. I forgot what it was called, like Rampage or something like that. No, that was a movie. Uh, but it was a, there was a video game where it was about you being a, a gunman and you're and the point of the game is to mow down crowds of innocent people like stuff like that. that. And there's a movie called Rampage about the same exact thing. Yeah, um, uh, it's a trilogy, actually. <laughs> but uh, it's so it's like it's like you said it's it's it, are you trying to make a statement or are you trying bring, bring awareness to it or are you making money off of of, of a sensitive stuff so, so i guess i guess time will tell i i'm wondering I, what, so far I, see, I haven't seen that the game was canceled so it's coming so i, I guess it's uh it's only a matter of time till we all find out what do you think? Is this a, is this a, a game that you would be interested in, like seeing a little bit? Like at least, at least check the trailer out, see what you think about it. Like maybe. <laughs> oh, I thought you were asking like. No, I'm asking you. Like, would you? I mean, if you take the trailer out, and if it's in, like, do you think it's something that you would even even play? 
I mean, I'm not a huge gamer to begin with. Yeah. So the odds of me like going out and buying this video game are relatively low. Mm-hmm. But, you know, I, I play some video games and I think it's definitely, again, I think I think it's just a lot of questions of like, how are we handling this? How are we going about this? Because I do think it's a really, from what I do know of the gaming industry, that is a huge, huge issue, like mistreatment of women in that industry and misogyny who, um, in that industry who stream themselves playing games and whatnot yeah and i think if it's opening doors to have that conversation and it's touching on that i, I think that is really important that is mm. something i would get behind and, and be curious to see and play but right. yeah you know, if, it, if it plays it off as more like a horror movie it's like yeah, For, yeah, it, that, yeah it could be that, just be a horror like, movie yeah. i don't know we also like then at that point it's like well we can't have serial killer slasher movies because serial killers kill people you know it's like yeah. i don't know i also don't know where you draw that line like, of like people are wondering are we chickening in the we, we can't we can't like use this because it has happened to someone right yeah that's that's true that thing you know what you're right i i'm i'm you know what now i'm i'm fit, I'm, I'm on board now like like i'm not i'm not saying this is something that should be made light of but at the same time just like any horror movie if we take if we come at it from that point it's it's just uh an, another like horror movie or, uh, and a lot uh, of horror movies have really insightful stuff to say when you actually get past the like yeah. you know there's a reason people are drawn to that it's like what is the psychology of a murderer what is the psycho you know what does drive people to do that so i don't know i think yeah. to me it's just a let's see what they have to say if if they have something to say even if it is through a, you know a bit of a a, a, a lens I, I think there's a, an argument to be made for that. Yeah, I mean, if any movie has proven that, like 365 DNI, yeah. So, guys, <laughs> let us know what you guys think about about this subject. You know, you know what? Do you know what this reminds me of? Me and you. I'm not going to say the name of the channel, but me and you were just t- uh, texting about a certain YouTube channel that kind of like reminded me of this a little bit, and I was mm-hmm. like, so it's 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 like, is this a situation where it's like? Um, the stalker or the villain in this game is thinking, oh, well, if you're putting yourself out there in a certain way, then, you know, you, I mean, yeah. uh, you, des- uh, you deserve this, ki- this type of attention. I mean, hell, even on this channel, there was a dude that we just, I uh, think we talked about it on We Got Your Mail, where somebody was thinking that a voice actor deserved it because of, of being associated. I mean, so people are, are nuts. So maybe this game is just pointing, it, uh, pointing out that there are some fans out there who take things too far. They blur, they blur lines, they cross lines. And that's probably what this game is just all about. Just a, a story uh, about things that actually just happened. But let us know what you guys think uh, about the, the the trailer that you saw. Uh, go check it out. It's called Gamer Girl. I think people had a, a problem with the title, too, because it was just like too simple. Like, OK, what are, you, what are you trying to say? Gamer Girls were like, what the hell are you trying to say? So let us know what you guys say uh, about it, about the whole thing. And we might talk about it on We Got Your Mail. So. Uh, What is the last trending topic that we have for today? 